Ah, it's the Burke of that gratitude guy. Innocence lost. I talked to some people recently that had some very difficult childhoods. Abuse, neglect, uh, grandparents, step-parents raising them, and so forth. And it made me, me reflect on a moment how I'm very good for the fact I came from a relatively normal family. Mother and father, there was a divorce later, but basically it was a decent, fairly good upbringing. Basic values, go to school, taken care of, uh, no abuse, things like this. And it really made me think about how many people I've come across who have an innocence lost type of background. And so today I think it's just a neat day just to reflect on what you're grateful for, for basically how you were brought up. In those cases where it, uh, maybe it was a step-parent or a grandparent or somebody that took care of you, let's be grateful for them. Let's be grateful for those fantastic parents that were out there nurturing you and taking care of you from the day you were born to the day you went off to school or college or whatever it might have been. And let's just think about those people and really realize how grateful we are. It's really something we don't have much control over, if any control of all. And that's the family we're born in. All of a sudden one day, we're here on this planet and we're given these set of parents and it just happens to be the way it works out. So take a moment today and be grateful for your parents, for your step-parents, your grandparents, for an aunt or uncle or whoever it was that really, really took care of you and nurtured you and raised you because many people didn't get that opportunity and, uh, and that's just how it sort of works sometimes. So be grateful for that today. Be writing your gratitude journal today. Maybe take a, sep a, a moment today to write a sentence or two on those people you're so grateful for that raised you. That's it for today. Have a grateful day. We'll see you tomorrow.